The Bharti Janata Party mocked Samajwadi Party chief Akhilesh Yadav after a poster proclaiming him as future prime minister surfaced outside the party's office in Lucknow saying no person can be stopped from daydreaming. Actor politician Gautabi Tadimala today resigned from the BJP alleging that some party leaders were helping a man she claimed betrayed and cheated her. Rajasthan CM Ashok Gehlot alleged that the BJP is using the enforcement directorate to harass the Congress. However bad a constitution may be, it may turn out to be good if those responsible for its functioning happen to be a good lot. Chief Justice of India D Y Chandrachur said while citing B R Ambedkar and hailing his idea of constitutionalism as being responsible for dismantling deeply entrenched caste hierarchy in India. Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal said removing the Bharatiya Janata Party from power in 2024 Lok Sabha polls will be the greatest act of patriotism as he accused the party of failing to lead the country towards progress despite being in power for two terms. As Cyclone Tej continues to brew into a severe cyclonic storm in the Arabian Sea, Cyclone Hamoon is in a premature stage in the Bay of Bengal. Indian cricket great Bishan Singh Bedi bred his last at the age of 77 after a prolonged illness. Bishan Singh Bedi was a left arm spinner who also captained the Indian team in 22 matches. Bedi was an active cricketer from 1967 to 1979 featuring for India in 67 tests taking 266 wickets. With the Delhi police finding crores of rupees lying in the bank accounts of Gurpreet Singh and accused in the murder of Swiss national Nina Burger even as they found rupees 2 crore when they raided Singh's home in West Delhi police investigators are probing the case from a human trafficking angle now Former Pakistani PM Imran Khan has been formally charged with leaking official diplomatic cables a case that could potentially result in a 10 year jail sentence and a lifetime of disqualification if the charges are proven Philippines releases video of Chinese coast guard ship colliding with Filipino supply boat. The incident happened in the disputed South China Sea near Second Thomas Shoal. China on the other hand accused Philippines of deliberately stirring up trouble. China views the situation in Gaza as very serious with the risk of a large scale ground conflict rising and the spread of armed conflicts along neighboring borders. Chinese state media said on Monday citing the country's Middle East special envoy. A sick man died in New York after being assaulted by a man after his car collided with his vehicle last week. 66-year-old Jasmeer Singh died of head injuries after the occupant of the other car attacked him following the crash.